Hey everybody, we just did a quick video on how to replace your rear wiper blade itself, but upon inspecting my wiper blade arm, I flipped up this back cap here and noticed that the plastic itself had cracked around the brass bushing um, that's underneath this nut. There's a lot of corrosion there, so I got a new arm assembly off of Amazon. It comes with this cap, it comes with the arm, and the new blade. So I'm going to show you how to install that. So for this procedure, we have a new wiper arm assembly and new blade from a company called AutoBoo on Amazon. Um, some green painter's tape, some PB blaster for penetrating oil, a rag and wire brush for cleaning, a 13 millimeter socket, a little red tube of blue Loctite thread lock, and then a cheapo pulling tool in case your wiper arm gets stuck with corrosion. What I'm doing here is I'm putting a rag underneath the nut so that I don't get PB Blaster spray all over the car and I'm just going to hit it a little bit where the nut meets the, th the threaded post and let that penetrating oil seep in between the threads and just give it some time and as that PB Blaster continues to soak I'm going to take our green painters tape roll just a little visual I'm just going to put this on the glass right there it's, it's pretty crude, but it's just a simple spot where if your window is really clean and you don't have a dirt line, you can tell which angle the wiper blade is at. So that when you put the new one on, you just match up the tip of the blade to where this um, tape is, and you'll be good to go. All right, so after letting this sit for probably three or four minutes, I'm going to take my 13 millimeter socket, put it on there, hold the wiper blade firmly with my other hand, and start taking this nut off. So it's getting considerably easier, which tells me that the nut did break free so that PB Blaster did its job. Now we pull the wiper arm free. Still stuck pretty bad right there. So before I try anything else, I'm gonna give it a little bit more blaster. I had the penetrating oil sitting there for a long time and it wasn't releasing the bushing from the post. There's a lot of corrosion in there. Um, I've heard of people, you know, still ripping the plastic off because it's cracked and then cutting the bushing loose. I'm not interested in getting metal shavings all around the paint and around this seam. I'm also not interested in yanking on this thing and putting a lot of axial misalignment on the motor behind the wiper arm itself. So you can save yourself a lot of heartache if you just go. I went to Advance Auto. This was like 10 bucks. Um, it's a really simple pulling tool. It's a little wonky, so you gotta have some patience with it. But basically how this works is you sneak these two clamps behind it. So make sure it's, it's clamped and behind the actual metal of the bushing itself and not just the plastic. And then as you screw this in, it will eventually lift this thing off. And that's how I got it off. So these are our three pieces for a wiper arm. It's like the regular OEM brand wiper. It snaps right in. You can pivot like that. And then the underside, this cap has two pins right there that go in these holes. All right, now that functions as the old one did. Now let's install it on the car. Okay, so here is my piece of green painter's tape that we had before. So I'm gonna take this protective covering off, pop this up, ease that onto the shaft, and just have that generally pointing towards the painter's tape where it was. That's the easy part. That's in place. Now we're gonna put the nut on. So this part's pretty straightforward. Um, before we put our nut on, I have this blue Loctite, number 242. It's just thread lock, so we're gonna put a drop of that on here, get the, new, get the nut started again. Put one hand in place, hold the wiper arm so we don't put any strain on the motor. And that's it. Close your cap, you're done. So if you found this helpful, please like it, share it, subscribe. Um, I have all the stuff we use today on Amazon linked below. And as always, if you haven't, follow our blog and our Instagram and our Facebook and post any comments or questions below. Thanks for watching How to Escape. We'll see you soon.